Hey guys and welcome back to the Mumbo channel. Today we are going to be doing a quick review of the Logitech MX Performance Mouse that I picked up a couple of weeks ago for £40 on sale from Amazon. This is going to take a pretty simple format, I will go through the good points, then the slightly less good points, and then do a little conclusion at the end. So of course one of the main positives of the Performance MX Mouse is how comfortable it is in the hand. I can happily use this for hours and end without having any issues, it just seems to mould to my hand perfectly, as if it's bespoke, or a tailored mouse as it were. Another big positive for me is that it looks the part. With a black finish and silver highlighting, it will make a nice addition to the desk. I personally use this on a mouse mat and so far I've had absolutely no problems with accuracy. I have heard it can be used on gloss and glass surfaces as well, but I'm yet to try that one out myself. The scroll wheel can be used in two different ways, I have it set up in the click to click mode, which I've found works really well. Alternatively you can use the ultra fast smooth scrolling mode, but I've found that far too fast for everyday use, flying to the bottom of web pages without even realising that I've done it, which is just a little bit problematic for me. This mouse comes with its own Logitech unifying receiver which allows you to connect up to 6 Logitech devices to your PC without needing any extra receivers. It also means that the hardware requirement for your PC is just a USB port which I'm sure has pretty much everyone covered. Finally, the battery life is decent. It lasts for 4-5 to five days on a full charge with relatively intensive use, which is considerably more than I was expecting. But that does bring me on to some of the more negative points. The first one is a little bit peculiar and I don't know if it's just my unit, but the charge cable seems to be really quite stiff, meaning that when the mouse is charging, it can be just a little bit tricky to manoeuvre, but as I say, that could be just me. The scroll wheel is good, but as I say, hyperfast mode is arguably too hyperfast, and middle clicking with the scroll wheel can be just a little bit tough, which is frustrating for someone like me who plays quite a lot of Minecraft and quite likes the pick block function. Another issue I've had more recently is that occasionally left click gets stuck down. It doesn't happen too often and I wouldn't say it's a deal breaker, but it may be something to think about. So there we have it ladies and gents. That rounds up this micro review of the Performance MX mouse by Logitech. All in all, it is a brilliant mouse for the price and despite some small issues, it really is a pleasure to you. So if you enjoyed this video, please be sure to hit that like button and if you really loved it, then make sure to subscribe. But thanks for watching guys, this has been Mumbo and I'm out. I'll see you later.